Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield, and welcome back to Full Throttle Remastered. Where I think I know where I went wrong with the, uh, with the bunnies. I need to pinch another box of them. Um, we don't want them just kind of all to charge out into the minefield on their own. I remember that I needed to pick them up, like, once I dropped them, so that they kind of... We can kind of let them go one at a time. It's, it's weird that you can't just do that initially, but, um... Yeah, we need to... We need to tackle this in a slightly different manner. I don't think I can progress any further until I get into the Vulture hideout, so... We need to... We need to do this. Right. There we go. Right, let me pick up as many of them as I can. I don't want to just leave one bouncing around. Come on. Right, there we go. You you go on your way, and then I think I need to follow up to where you explode, explode, and drop another one down. I don't want to set off any of these boys. No, I know you don't. But what we need to do? Drop him down there. Jeez. Okay. Slow and systematic is the way, Ben. Right, yep. There we go. Just enjoy the music! <laughs> it's so bloody dumb. Slowly making our way across. I think this is for probably going to be getting us further than the uh, the trick of just dumping them all on the floor at, one, at once. Bloody hell, that one didn't take much, did it? Oh! Oh, we made it. Well, okay, hi. That's the guy I was telling you about, Susie. You sure? Yeah, that's the guy who killed my father. All right, vultures. That's not how it up. happened. Oh God. Let's rip him quick. Oh, please don't. You're making a big mistake. Oh, Ben, you're right. We shouldn't do this quickly. We should draw this out, don't you think, Susie? Hey, I got all night. You heard her, kids. Let's draw this out. Mm. Oh, don't do that. Oh, God. Okay. Um. Not your father. Don't you dare talk about my father, you heartless bastard. <laughs> I'm, try I'm, trying to I'm trying to help. Corley and I. I said shut up about my dad. Uh. Malcolm once. I said shut up about my dad. I can't say anything that involves. Um. Malcolm himself. Okay, that's enough. Mm, not quite. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, it was worth a try. I'm innocent. You're in something, all right. Mm -hmm. I'm losing my temper, Marine. Hey, you're about to lose much more. Yeah, okay. Let me go, or else. Or else what? Uh. I'll get blood all over your driveway. I mean, duh. I'll get blood all over your driveway. That's good for the landscaping, actually. Oh, damn. <laughs> Let me go, or else. Or else what? Mm. I'll call you names. Yeah. I'll call you names. <laughs> like what? Uh, the diaper dynamo. That's the one we want. Diaper dynamo. How? How'd you hear that name? Your father. He told me just before he died. You bludgeoned my father and then talked about old times? I didn't kill him. Rip Burger did. A photographer took pictures, but her camera was stolen by the same thug that came after you. I... I still have that role. Well, develop it, would you? While I still fit in my clothes? Okay, you stay here. Hey. Uh, <laughs> don't... For fuck's sake. Sorry. Mm. Yeah, well, don't sweat it. I'm gonna get Rip Burger even if I die trying. No, we have to expose Rip Burger at the shareholders meeting. That way, we take him down, we save my gang, and your father gets his dying wish. You take over Corley Motors. Rip Burger canceled the shareholders meeting. He made a statement to the press that there'd be no meeting until the murderers were brought to justice. So? 
No shareholders meeting until we're both dead. Hmm. Mm. That could be arranged. Okay, Ooh. so here we go. Faking Ben and Maureen's death. Act one, scene one. Adrian Ripburger, in a desperate attempt to lure our Maureen out of hiding, has developed the following lame-ass scheme. First prize at tonight's smash-up derby is a vintage hardtail that Mo restored with her dad. Rip hopes Mo will try to nab said bike on account of her sentimental attachment to it. So Ben and Mo play along, put on disguises, and enter the demolition derby which ends tragically when their cars explode and both are presumed dead. Uh, question. Please save your questions until the end. <laughs> now, the explosives in Moe's car can only be triggered by a head-on collision with Ben's car. This ejector seat projects Moe clear of the explosion and she parachutes to safety. Don't you think someone will notice her rejecting out of her car? Mm. No. They'll all be watching you running around on fire. Oh. Yeah, that's another question I have. When your car explodes, you climb from it in flames and run around the stadium distracting the audience. In your cute little asbestos suit, of course. <laughs> that's some plan. Yeah. All right, then. Let's go blow your little darlings up. All right, folks. Okay. Hang on to your chili dogs, because it's time to start. The Corley Motors Smashatorium Amateur Driver Ultimate Destruction Maximum Carnage Marathon. That's one hell of a title. Cage gladiators. That mysterious looking hooded figure wouldn't give us his real name. He prefers to be known as the Unknown Avenger. <laughs> just fine with us, isn't it, folks? Now I'm just embarrassed for them. Who do they think they're fooling with those ludicrous disguises? And next to him is another masked newcomer. Please give a big smashatorium salute to the princess of Pile Up, Doreen Smorley. <laughs> All right, boys. <laughs> Sick of me. And finally, we have a last minute addition. I wonder who that could be. Oh, Jesus. It's a bit snug in there, isn't it? Oh, yes, we are. Oh, bloody hell. Here I come. Right, okay. Um, oh god, how do I drive? Oh, right, okay, oh god. Oh, this drives like ass. Oh, I'd forgotten how bad this was. Uh, oh, you, you fuck off, mate. Right, okay. Watch out for the Boom Boom Brothers, Mo. Yeesh, go away. Oh, this is awful. It's all being controlled with the mouse. Like, I have to... Ben, what are you doing? <coughs> Get over here and nail me. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, I, I can't get to her that way. Oh, God, these controls are all... Fuck off, mate! Number 11, piss off! Thanks for the thanks for the little boost there. That's appreciated. Right, I need to ramp up over this. Oh, for fuck's sake! Come on! Why could this not control with the bloody keyboard? I I I I am really fucking trying to. Forever. Oh no, what do you want me to do about it? I, this is the only ramp that I can take, and I can't even... <sighs> yeah, in, or in order to turn the car left, I have to move the mouse to the left. In order to move the car to the right, or turn right, I have to do the opposite. Like, this is the most ridiculous fucking control scheme. 
fuck off! Oh, why are you always there? <clears throat> I can't get over him. Fuck off, you dipshits! Fuck off! Oh, this is the worst. How in the no, no, not mm. that guy right. swore when I bounced off the roof. Oh. Looks like these babies have a glass jaw. Did I have to figure that out first? Well, it doesn't matter because I can't fucking land on you, can I? Oh, fuck off! Oh, hang on, hang on. Just remembered what I need to do. No. Fucking come here, you. Oh, you gobshites. I don't know what number 27 is doing. They're, they're just. What is this? Why is a car that hovers being affected by oil on the floor? No, you fuck off. Right, that that better be enough. That's all I can say. Okay, boom boom brothers. It's mm. all over. I fucking hope so. Yes. Get him. Oh. <laughs> I'm taking a nap. Oh. Idiots. Okay, Mo. Time for our big finale. Do it. Do it. Whoa, okay. It's an explosion, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Can't see any survivors. Wait, what's that? It's the unknown Avenger, and he's on fire. He is. Let's give him a hand, folks. That looks painful. <laughs> Please put him out. This is your moment to shine. Can we go and grab their car? Go fuck him up. What a pain What am I meant to do here? Well, we should put him out. Don't you think? Oh. Well, okay, you heard of him. Alright, tell you what, let's but I can't get through that door. Why can we not get through the Alright, tell you what, we'll go in here. Shall we? Oh, oh. <laughs> Just set everything on fire. Man, quit clowning around and make a diversion. I am a diversion. <laughs> no offense, but we need a bigger one. The bike is guarded. Who cares about the bike? Mo says it's important, so we're not leaving without. All right, I'll see what I can do, but I'm burning at both ends here. Yeah. Still no sign of Miss Morley. Right. Okay. Let me let me just. Uh. <laughs> That's all it took was one additional bit of flame. Right. Okay. There we go. Everybody's fleeing. Good. Get out. <laughs> Finally. Ooh. Now squish that firefly while he's hot. Oh, please don't. Please just let me run. <laughs> Look at him run. Is that your, just your fucking catchphrase, mate? Oh, God. Um, bunny? I need to be able to get out here. Right, 
Okay, helpful. I, I... What do we do here? I don't even remember. Oh, right, jump on them. <laughs> Tyrone? Perhaps? Or... No. How about an explosive bunny? Oh, no, there we go. Are you fucking serious, Ben? Come on, come on, come on. Why won't you just leave? There we go, we're out. Okay, finally. Are you fucking kidding me? Why? Alright, I tell you what, I'll get him to chase me through the fire. Bet that'll fucking work, won't it? Yeah, that's done it. This is what happened. Did you get him? We finally got him, Bolas. That means Ripburger has to make us vice presidents now, like he promised. <laughs> and give us 10,000 shares of stock each. Mmm. Hmm. Funny smell. What's that? The temperature light? <laughs> well, on the bright side. I just made 20,000 shares of stock. I suppose Time you did. the shareholders meeting. Where's the hard tail? All over the floor, Mr. Avenger. What? What happened to your deep sentimental attachment to your father's vintage bike? Ben, it's just a bike. I can put it back together in about a half an hour. That's assuming, of course, I can find that key. Ooh. What key are you talking about? Key to my dad's safe. I remember he hid it somewhere on this bike, but I've looked everywhere and I can't find anything that even looks like a key. Hmm, okay. What's in the safe that's so important? My dad's will. I'm counting on him to tell the truth about me, finally. Why did he keep you a secret all these years? He didn't want people to find out about my mom. What's so bad about Mrs. Corley? She wasn't my mom. Huh. Oh. Child of a little bit of an affair, I think. How was your flight? Well, there were some explosions during takeoff, and I landed in a minefield. But other than that, <laughs> it was fine. Oh, good. I'm fine, by the way. Thanks for asking. Uh -huh. Great. Now help me find that key. I suppose. Um, uh, but how are we going to get in the factory? In the back of the factory, there's a secret entrance that leads straight into Dad's office. He used to sneak hmm. me in so I could help him with his bike designs. When he got too old to do all the work himself? Nah, this is back when I was six. Hmm. <laughs> How do I find the secret passage? Well, it's tricky. You have to wait for all the utility meters to turn black. Then you kick the wall in just the right spot and you're in. Oh, uh, right. How do I find the right spot to kick? Dad just knew exactly where to kick it. But I remember that there was this big crack in the wall, and if I lined up that crack with my eye level and kicked the wall right in front of me, this weird portal would open up. Mm -hmm. What are we in, anyway? It's a C-330 Big Mouth Industrial Cargo Jumbo Transport we fixed up. We want to get it rolling so we can take it to biker rallies. You're going to try to fly this thing? Rolling, Ben. <laughs> rolling. Uh, this baby's flying days are over, just like mine. Hmm. What if I can't find that spot? Just line up your eyes with the crack, wait for the meters to go black, and kick. Okay. Um, I was, yeah. Remember that time you tried to kill me? Yeah, we really taught you a lesson. Oh. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> okay, well, let's go and see what we can do. I'll see what I can do. Right. Uh, anything in the parts? Ooh, any numbers that might be significant? Hmm. 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 Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. 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 Hmm.
lots of numbers. Hmm. I'm not sure which one of those is going to actually come in handy. Hmm. I should probably write, write these down. Okay, I made a note of those. Maybe I will be able to use them. Here, take the photos. I don't want them. Show them to someone important if you get a chance. I will. Alright, so we need to go in here now. Alright. Is it this bit we need to I'll beat it up later when I have more time. Not that one. No, that's the hatch. Seal shut. Yeah, it's that bit. I'll bet. Yeah, because that that cracks eye level. So, boot. No. Hmm. Like, there's lots of cracks here. I'm trying to remember where this, where this bit was. I could have sworn it was like this little bit here. It doesn't seem to be. What am I kicking wrong? That starts registering as the hatch again there. Not this bit. No. These must be the meters Mo was talking about. I needed a crack at eye level. But I mean, was that eye level for when Mo was little? Or now? Oh wait, I got it! Bloody hell. Okay. Oh, fantastic. Right, in we go. It's got a very, uh, kind of, almost like a Mr. Burns office sort of look to it, doesn't it? Okay, I think I might uh, leave things off here for this episode. That Destruction Derby just kind of took it out of me. F I forgot how annoying that bit was. Um, but I don't think there's much left of the game, so I don't want to be kind of rushing through everything immediately. Uh, but we're going to have some fun going through here and framing Rip Burger. So yeah, I think I'll leave things off here for this episode. For now, I'm going to wrap it up here and just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays or Metal Covers and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, subscribe on YouTube, chuck me a follow over on Twitch, or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off. Uh... That's the first time I've seen them lay eggs. They genuinely just fart them out. <laughs>